Okay, guys, uh, sitting here with a few of the PS2 games. I still gotta find out where Pinoni Musha too. But, uh, yeah, I'm gonna show you all the games that are in the case. But, uh, here's some ones that have their own separate case. I got Shadow of the Colossus. Indigo Prophecy. This game's pretty, uh, cool. I think it's by the same creators that did, uh, Heavy Rain. It's a pretty badass game. Nobody's played yet. <laughs> and I like a night beyond. I tell you, this game really freaked me out. <laughs> it's fucking creepy. It's like going around, you can see these ghosts and shit. And there's this part where you're on the bridge. And that's all I'm gonna say. <laughs> and uh, this game called Kenjo, Kengo or whatever. I thought it was gonna be cool because it's a samurai game, <laughs> but uh. This one's not not all that good. <laughs> Just to let you know. Let's see. Gotta bust open the case. <laughs> Starting from the top left, we have extermination. If my webcam stops screwing up, it keeps going really slow. What the hell? Okay. Apparently it's being really slow for some reason. Got cold fear. Put those back in there. Webcam's acting up really weird tonight. <laughs> Samurai Jack. The uh, Shadow of Aku. <laughs> and uh, we got the Simpsons Road Rage. Not sure if, how good that's going to work. Some of these games have a little bit scratches, but uh, about 80% to 90% of them work. So, just to let you know, I'll tell you which ones don't work if I uh, come across them. But next, with, next up we got Taito Legends. This has a few of the Sega games, like, uh, what do you call it, Space Invaders, like arcade games and all. Of course, you know, little Space Invader guy right there. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I was hoping at least something was going to have Sonic on it, because I have another one that I thought had Sonic, but apparently not. <laughs> Next up, we got True Crime, Streets of L.A. This one works every now and then, so not sure how good it's going to do. <laughs> PlayStation works perfectly, just to let you know. Okay, we got Zatch Bell, Momoto Battles. This one works pretty great because it barely has any scratches. SOCOM, U.S. Navy SEALs 3. Now, for some reason, this one stopped working, working for me. I don't know why. I mean, you could probably get it buffered up, and it might work. But, uh, I'm not sure. Damn, getting these games back in this case, I'm telling you. Sucks. Okay, next up. Shonen Jump's One Piece Grand Battle. After that, we got Extreme Legends Dynasty Warriors 3. Sometimes this one will mess up, but it's a great game. <laughs> it's like, it was the first Dynasty Warriors game I played. <laughs> it's pretty good, though. Then we got Yu Yu Hakusho Dark Tournament. Now, this works all the way up to the part you're about to get to the, like, the astral planes but I still say it's the best Final Fantasy, it's Final Fantasy X it only works up to that part then for some reason the video just keeps playing keeps looking around on the astral plane <laughs> it doesn't continue, I had a bar of my friend Richard's the one year in high school because it just wouldn't work <laughs> okay we got Pull these out. We got Guitar Hero. And Guitar Hero 2 is in the PlayStation in the next room. We got Guitar Hero 3. And Guitar Hero World Tour. And uh, I got two Guitar Hero controllers. There's one. That's a wireless. And then, uh, 
and yeah, I got the receiver piece somewhere over that way. And uh, and the other one is wired, but it doesn't have the whammy bar. So if you're looking to do the tremolo part, it's not going to happen. The next two we have up is God of War and God of War 2. God of War series is one of my favorite series of video games. Freedom just kicks ass. For anybody that likes RPG, we got Grandia too. Next up, we got Sega Classic Collections. Now this has like the games from like the eight and one. It has a uh, the Ninja game and you know the shit like that. If you ever play that on the regular Sega, but um. I was really hoping it was going to have Sonic. If it had Sonic, I would have been happy as hell, but no. <laughs> they jip you out. I was so pissed. I was like, really? Fucking assholes, man. <laughs> okay. We got Conflict Desert Storm. I tried playing it like once, I think, but I don't even remember what the hell you do with it. And we got the we got Devil May Cry. That's the first one. Did have the case somewhere, but I forgot the hell happened to him. No clue where all the cases went for half these games. We got Siren. This game's just really fucking. This was creepy as shit too. <laughs> if you if you're the one that buys the PlayStation, the PS2, you'll find out. <laughs> it's fucking creepy. Then we got Pirates, Legend of the Black Buccaneer. This one's not that bad. I only pl I only played like probably an hour into it, and I stopped. Then we got Light Grand Theft Auto Vice City. Now, this one yeah, it's so it's a little kind of it's, it's a little scratched up and all. I don't know if the if you can see any of it, <laughs> yeah, it doesn't even show it on the screen, but it still works. Same thing with Grand Theft Auto 3. They both work, so it's good. And the PS2 comes with a memory card, just to let you know, and one controller. Next up, Red Faction, Join the Revolution. It's a first person kind of shooter. Uh, puzzle, you can't, I don't even know. <laughs> well, I played a little bit, but then I stopped. Hunter the Reckoning Wayward is the next one. This game, I seriously haven't even played it since I bought it. <laughs> My friend played it, but I watched him, I don't even remember what the hell you're doing. Okay. Sadly, this does not work. It only works up to where when you first start out and you're riding the bike and after like a couple of minutes and it just stops. So if you got a buffer or something, you might go to fix Grand Theft Auto San Andreas. But nope, it doesn't work. <laughs> after that we got Pirates of the Caribbean, the Legend of the Black I mean Legend of Jack Sparrow. I was about to say the first movie title, what the fuck? <laughs> Is pretty decent as well. It's up Sandy. Now, if I can get the, uh, the last two games up. Okay. Next up, we got uh, Legend of, or no, Samurai Legend Musashi. This game, to me, is a great game. Normally, I don't like cartoon games, but kind of, I don't know, in a way it kind of reminds me of Kingdom Hearts, like the way the graphics are and shit, so you know, you guys can check that out, yeah, I loved it until uh, I got pretty far, and then my friend had to take his PS2 back, and the memory card disappeared, I was like, fuck, and right after that, we got Amplitude, now if anybody's played Guitar Hero, this is Amplitude. It came out before Guitar Hero, I believe. Actually, yeah, it did. Like years ago. 
and you basically just use the three like a three button sequence and all and you just go for that, you know, it just gets faster in the game and all, but it's actually pretty easy to master. It's got different music in there and all that. I think you would love it. If you love music, you'll love that game. <laughs> so that's pretty much all the games in the case and let me know if you are interested. We'll start off price at whoever posts whatever price first. Okay. Peace out.